Here's Payne out to the left-hand side. It's Musa Sano out on that far left. Dutch player inside to Payne once more. Gets in a bit of a tangle. Naismith dispossesses him. And a chance for Pompey to break over the halfway line. Here's Kyle Bennett picking up his head. He's got Curtis Main outside him. Here's Curtis Main into the box. And he just slides it past the post. He thought it might have crept in the corner there, but not on this occasion. The first opportunity of the game, it goes to Pompey. Crawley playing quite a, an advanced shape, certainly looking to press Pompey in those defensive areas. Perhaps Harry Kuehl has noticed that uh, Pompey are weak defensively. Of course, so much analysis and research goes into games these days, even though they are just checker trade games. And here's a nice weaving run from Matt Clark. That's a great piece of skill from the centre half. And he's bursting into Crawley territory. Finds Curtis Main in the box. Curtis Main once more. Well stopped by Merson, but finished off by that man, Matt Clark. A foul on Danny Rose and Naismith will deliver a free kick into the penalty area. It's not a bad ball. It's a good header on target and it's finished off by Oliver Hawkins. Which, uh, which you know, which is one of the reasons why he can play fullback. So plenty of opportunity to tackle in that holding. Given away by Crawley Town. Here's Kyle Bennett. Oh, how has he missed? Kyle Bennett, he can't believe it. His head's in the turf. He took it around the goalkeeper, Mersan, and from 18 yards, just ballooned it over the crossbar with his left foot. Wow, what an opportunity to make it three for Pompey. And here come Crawley through the centre. Could this be a dangerous blow? It can. And Crawley Town have one back. Well, and two efforts of his were spilled by the keeper, or parry, parried away by the keeper at least, and resulted in two Portsmouth goals. Ball inside from Crawley, can only find Kyle Bennett, who's managed to worm his way into the penalty area. Here's Kyle Bennett, lays it across for Stuart O'Keefe, and Pompey re-established their two-goal advantage here.